Hello, hello everyone. It is me, it is Sharpie Miss Potato coming at you. I hope you're having a lovely day. So this is, uh, this is actually Metro 2033. This is the Redux or Redo edition. I'm not sure how it's pronounced, but, um, yeah, this is, um, this game is based on some, uh, a series of books that is, uh, I think in the either Russian or Ukrainian subway system with lots of mutants and stuff like that, as far as I know. I've never played it, never played any of the Metro series, so this is, will be a first for me. So without further ado, should we just hop right in? Let's do that. Uh, choose a place style. Survival Spartan. Survival sounds good to me. Enjoy the forgiving combat stealth experience of Metro. It's like with Spartan style, the perfect place to like faster pace, more action. Survival style is the original horror. Okay, let's do the horror mode, I guess. So Spartan sounds like it's more combat focused, whereas this is more horror. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. I hate horror games, but oh, and I don't even know what I clicked then. One sec. The tunnel grew colder. Miller and I were close to the surface now. Soon, we would climb up into the howling wind to fight our way through whatever nightmares were waiting there. My long journey was nearly at the end. But would I have the courage, the will to see it through? So there we go. Let's get to it. Hey, Artyom. When you left your home station, did you ever think we'll end up in a place like this? Not knowing whether we were about to save our world or send it straight to hell. to get through the military outpost to reach the surface, Artyom. Okay, just need to turn the mouse sensitivity down. That's better. Yes, I did. Open the gate, I'll cover. How do I open it? Ah. Shit is always breaking down in here. Use the auxiliary hand system to open the gate. So I think this will have similar vibes to like Wolfenstein that we played recently. But a bit more horror orientated. Artyom, check those crates for ammo and med bags. Sorry, I just want to see if I can control the video. Let's find game options. Oh, I was just seeing if I could lower the FOV a bit because it's quite uh, zoomed in. What am I checking? Crates. Where are the crates? Ready, Artyom? Follow me. Okay. Up we go. Up we go. Oh, I've got a flashlight. Okay, nice. Mm -hmm. Seems like nobody's home. Before we hit the surface, put your gas mask on. Without you, could be like a goldfish out there. Gas mask, okay. This is the Korolev performance hall. It's really close to the tower. weapon. Suki, here they come. The recoil on this is insane. Screen shaking all over the place. Got oh, loads of them. Oh. 
Let's move on. Glad to see you, Colonel. You hear that? Listen. What the hell is it? Turn the circle! The stampede. Ammo. I'm, I'm out of ammo. I can't do anything. I was maybe meant to preserve my ammo there. Is that meant to happen, maybe? Maybe that's why I went out of ammo. Maybe, maybe it's intended. Life was never easy in the tunnels. But it was our home. There was comfort in its routines, in seeing the same people day after day. But since the mutant attacks had escalated, fear ruled the station. I had just turned 20, and could never have imagined what would follow on the morning that my stepfather's friend Hunter arrived at the barricade. There you go. Magical. Magical stuff. Artyom, <laughs> you wake at last, I see. Hunter's on his way in. He should have news from the other stations. Come on. Let's go, Artyom. Shit. Pigs, disease. I've been through worse, and I'm not giving up. What's your plan for that? Alex. Yes, Nikolai? The station can't survive much longer if these attacks don't stop. We must do something. <sighs> what more can we do? We'll see what Hunter says. Come on, Alex. Hello, Artyom. 
That guy's got an epic base. That's just like a good, good head right there. How are the wounded? Uh, not much improvement. Two died this morning. The dark ones do not kill outright, but they damage a victim's mind. Sooner or later, this leads to death. I can't get it. I, I can't. I, I can't reach. Wait. Don't keep away from me. What the hell? Who could that be? It's Hunter. Mutants don't knock first. Open the damn gate. Welcome to Exhibition Hunter. Thanks. Now close your gate. It's been a long time, Hunter. Good to see you, Alex. Hello, Artyom. So, Hello. Hunter, what's happening in the outside world these days? Not much. Most of what I hear is about exhibition and the undead infesting your tunnels. <laughs> Artyom, I met a trader selling old postcards of New York City. I thought of your wall. Creatures. This is something else. What the hell? Something much worse. <laughs> Dark ones. Well, whatever in hell they are, my order has a motto. If it's hostile, you kill it. It's Dark all ones the not... in shaft. They're coming in from above. Shit. Just what we need. There are wounded here just behind the wall. The whole Kirill, take your group to the tunnels. Alex, Hunter and... We must stay here and defend the hall. All right, oh, Artyom, quickly get a weapon. They never come this far into this station. It's the hospital. They smell the blood. Got a feeling that door's gonna bust open. damage he's a dead eye shot this one no dark ones here just the usual tunnel trash even when you don't see them the dark ones are there fear that's their weapon that's what made the new solaces run through the tunnels like rats the dark ones are not simple mutants they're homo novice the next step in evolution you've heard about survival of the fittest Guess what? We lost. What's happened to you, Alex? You can go like lambs to the slaughter. I'll hang on to whatever life I got with teeth and claws. And I'll take more than a few of your homo novice with me to help. You think you're some old movie cowboy? Have a look, Hunter. Ten soldiers, trained in combat. Their bodies broken, their minds gone. The Dark Ones! They destroyed the outer guard post!
The devil knows what's happening out there, beyond your perimeter. I must go recon the situation. Listen carefully, Atium. If I'm not back here by morning, you must get to police station and find a man named Miller. Tell him what's happened to me, and what's stirring in the northern tunnels. Show this to Miller, so he knows I've sent you. I trust everything to you, Artyom. Don't let me down. Okay. If we are to survive, this threat must be eliminated, no matter the cost. Eliminated. Understand? Sure thing. Easy. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hunter did not return. It wouldn't be easy to find an excuse to leave the station and travel to Polis, but I had given my word. I learned that the caravan was heading to Riga the next day and needed guards. I signed on for the ride. Okay. Finally! Taking your time as usual, huh? All right, grab your gear, go to the platform, they're waiting for us. I'll meet you there. Hey, Artyom, don't forget anything, huh? Roger that. Вот что от перевертаться бабушка здорова. Вот что от перевертаться кожа и комплект. Вот что от перевертаться и мечтать снова. Вот что от перевертаться перевезет на лед. Okay, that's everything, I guess. Hey, that's some nice music. Hey, well, where did you get that echo? Oh, doing a bit of cooking there. Big head. Definitely halal. So I ask him, can you So they've still got meat. I thought that they wouldn't have any meat because of the radiation or whatever it is. Good weapons make good soldiers. Now you have to like customize your weapons. The scope, bullets. It's all silencer. Uh, uh, yeah, man. no. Don't need a silencer in this game, surely. Artyom, where's your gear? No, go to the armory and get geared up. Hello, Artyom. Is this the armory? The boots, not the armory. Hello, Artyom. You need some weapons? Okay, let's take a look. Submachine gun, 5.45 caliber, made in the armory. It's got poor accuracy and overheats like hell. <laughs> That's why they call it a bester gun. <laughs> Use short bursts, Artyom. Help yourself to some ammo, too. Here's a universal charger to keep the battery powered. And a gas mask. Put it on if you crossed any radiation hot zones. Or, God help you, go up to the surface. Army issue first aid kits, just in case. Okay, you're supplied, my friend. Feel free to try out your weapon on my firing range. And uh, you try not to stick out your head too much, okay? No, I don't need to try it out. I think we could. We know how to shoot. Yeah, I don't think so. Do you think one day we could go back up to the surface? I've never seen Moscow. Ooh, there's the pigs. So this is how they How about the pig look? Mighty fine pet, I must say. Oh, lots of pigs. Artyom, here! Here! Move in! Previous! So you're ready to move out? Ready. Are you ready? Well, let's go then.
You take that seat, Artyom. And you, Eugene, take this one. Did anybody forget anything? So, uh, you get your gear? Let's go then. Hey guys, going to Riga? Yeah, we are. Can I get a lift? Sure, but no free rides. You'll have to pull the lever sometimes. <laughs> I can do that. Let's go then. I'll ride it then. Good luck to everyone staying home, and to us too. Oi. Let's go. Good luck to us. So, are you ready to finally be somewhere else? Whoa! Artyomka! Free at last, huh? Well, for as long as the ride takes, anyway. Should be fun. More dangerous. Even better, right? <laughs> the first time I had left the safety of my home station. It troubled me that I hadn't told my stepfather the truth. I would not be heading straight back from Riga. But Hunter was depending on me. There you go. So, where are you from? Riga. I'm making the rounds, buying merchandise. Well, I bet you've seen a few places then. Yeah, the market is right go, next go, to Riga, go. and that's a big metro already. I used to make regular trips to police, but getting there now requires a lot of luck. That or being for well, a safe trip. I'd love to ride that thing. Hansa connects to the whole metro, and has a lot of stations. But doesn't welcome outsiders. And if it's not Hansa, then you have to go through the Reds, the Nazis, or your regular bandits. And these guys are really going at it lately. If they're not fighting everyone else, they're warring with each other. So I think this is Ukraine then, if they're talking about the Reds. Unless they mean... No, Reds would be Russia, surely. It just wouldn't be China, would it? Slow down, guys! Peter, what's up? A military caravan got stuck near Alexeyevskaya. A tunnel collapse or other shit. You have to use a service tunnel bypassing Alexeyevskaya. Ah, oh, fuck. I hate this tunnel. All right, Peter. Open up the gate. No point being stuck here forever. Why? Well, what's wrong with that tunnel? Well, it's an ordinary tunnel. Not as well lit, maybe. I went through that last month and, well, I just don't like it. That's all. Reminds me of the uh, Half-Life intro. Welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. We're riding a hand so I think we'll make it there okay. Oh, gun just came out automatically, so that's fantastic. Oh, damn, that's my head hurt. If you help push the lever, we'll get there sooner. Okay, Eugene, you go help the men. We should move faster here. You watch the back, Artyom. Sure, I'll help. That way we'll get to Riga in the back. Right? That's the back. Now, we should get out of here sooner. It's better be watching in front, around. honestly. And I pity them. Them? Who, who, who them? Can you hear them weep? Whom do you mean, them? What are you talking about? Huh? What, what the hell is going on? What? What is? What, what is? What is? <clears throat> what? What's happening to me? Uh, uh, oh dear, what's happening? Vas is das. Artyom! Over here! If we, we are, are to survive, survive this threat must, must be eliminated, eliminated no, no matter, matter the, the cost. cost. Eliminate. Lender man. Uh -huh. Looks like he's got a gas mask on, like adapted, merged to his face or something. This is very strange. Everyone 
Is that a hooligan? What is wake up, Boris? Shit, it's no good. Don't know which way I should be looking. Ah, oh God! Ah, shoot them! You shoot them! Take the ladders! Come on! Oh man! Bad time to reload. I'm out of ammo again. Oh man. Nice. Oh, there goes him. See you later. Hope he wasn't an important character to the story. You really have to reload your guns a lot here. Oh, I'm still alive. After playing Titanfall 2, the combat in this seems so clunky. Because the guns in Titanfall 2 just felt so freaking awesome. Shooting me. He's alive! Come here quick! Don't use the flamethrower! Please! Give him a chance! That was hot! I need a drink. Riga station was only the first stop on my journey, but the caravan went no further. So, before parting ways, we drank to celebrate our survival. Mm -hmm. I hope it didn't drown my fear of traveling on to Polis alone, but I was about to find myself with an unexpected and notorious partner. Okay. It'll be her over there. You All right, boys. Let's train to our friend Artyom, who goes right through monsters and anomalies alike. To Artyom. To you. Hell, if not for you, Artyom, we'd have been shredded like cabbage. You deserve a medal. <laughs> or at least some extra ammo. Here, take them. To your health. Let's try that. To you! Artyom, you really immune to that shit? See if that shroom vodka knocks him down, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we've got to check that. To our luck! And to Artyom! To, to your health! Shoop, shoop, shoop. Ah, the vodka kicks everyone's ass, huh? So tell me, the tunnel to markets closed down and I'm bored to death sitting here on my ass. We passed through some kind of invisible wave. We all blacked out. When I came I got place, my rights, Blitz! Let me out of the station! Hey, what the hell do you care if I leave or die? I don't care, asshole. But I got my orders. Yeah, 
Are you Artyom? Hey, there's a man at the Black Street waiting for you. I'll guide you there for one bullet. No thanks. Okay, find him yourself then. I will. I will find him myself, don't worry. Scrooge. Come here. You're our team, right? Sit down. Everybody calls me Bourbon. Listen, okay. I need to get to Dry Station for some business, but this rat hole is on lockdown. I, however, know a back way. A so-called cursed passage the locals are afraid to use. But I hear the shit in the tunnels doesn't work on you. So, you help me get to dry, I'll give you my AK when we get there. Deal? Good. Here's an advance payment in case you need to gear up first. Are you ready? Ready. Sitting in this crap hall is useless. I'm going to give this game a chance. I'm not 100% sold on it so far. Just because it feels very sort of dated. With like the combat and the voice acting is a bit... I don't know. It's just a bit... Maybe I should be playing it in Ukrainian. So like the graphics aren't too bad, but it's just the gunplay and the combat feels super clunky, like really dated. Um, voice acting is a bit weird in English. And mm, it might get better. As I entered the abandoned tunnel with Bourbon, I wondered if I'd been wrong to trust him. But the station gates were still sealed, and there was no telling when I'd have another chance to leave Riga. Great, we broke free. Now keep your eyes peeled. The handcar ride is over. Lots of tough guys died in these tunnels. But if we watch each other's backs, we'll get there. Oh my god, I'm out of ammo. Nice. Uh, he had some ammo. Why is it on fire randomly? That was random. Difficulty, normal, hardcore, normal, text, language, English, gamma, hints, subtitles, okay. 
the same mode. Hold different controls, video controls. Okay. Avoid the holes in the floor. Lots of ammo, lovely. Ah, I see you can swap different guns. What is this? Flamethrower, I think. Or what? Also, where's our friend gone? Oh, there he is. but quite efficient. If you want to arrive unexpected, try not to disturb the cans. Watch your step. Any crunch or crackle give you away. An excellent way to get rid of the blind and their devils. You get what to do? Oh my god, I jumped over that. Fighting the humans in this game, that's for sure. I don't know. I expected this game to be scarier as well. It's, uh, it's just more like an FPS, but it's given me like similar vibes to Wolfenstein, but not as action packed.
seems you can speed run it as well just by going ahead of that guy rather than waiting for him. the question I mean I would expect this way but can't see anywhere to go here oh my god why do you have battery on your flashlight that's a bit weird Probably have to go back for that geezer, don't I? Oh, fantastic. Okay. Let's try that again. I can hear him fighting people, he's like shouting, reloading and stuff, but I'm just way ahead of him. So why is there no melee attack? That's just weird. There should be a melee attack. Oh, there is. V. That's random. Oh, I've got throwing knives as well. See, it doesn't even teach you any of this. That's weird. That's it? I definitely can't jump back that way. Because that's what we tried before. To do here really other than go back and find our friend oh random wow, that was right. what have, what has he been doing all this time Time, sir. A cave in ship. And the staircase. How convenient. Seems to me we're being lured in. Back it. Let's go.
Okay. On we go. What do I do here then? This is cool. I like this. There was a horror game uh, FPS back in the day, I recall. I can't remember what his name was, but it had that sort of style to it. It was a really nice game, actually. It was like a supernatural FPS game. And it had this kind of aesthetic to it, like this. Artyom. <laughs> God tells me something is very wrong with this place. Remember our agreements. I'm counting on you, kid. Come on. <laughs> nice little grail. I promise you, dear, I will come back and lubricate you. Also get your new paint. I hear you are calling me. Come on. Get it free there. Going insane. Why is that illegal alien touching me up? What the hell just happened to me? Artyom, did you hear those songs? No, I didn't. Did you? I wouldn't wish it on an enemy. That is not the way. So what, we can't go through there? Because I guess you need this suit to go through or something. Maybe this is the way, maybe I just gotta wait for this guy. Which is super annoying. I wish he would hurry up. What's he doing up there? Come on. Ugh, 
Come on. I have to go up and let him go first, I guess. Yeah, come on. Hey, people! Open up! Don't let your two-legged brethren die a foolish death! Monkey bars. Oh, hello. What a coincidence! I was just coming to visit you! You hear that, boys? Set out the good dishes! Bourbons come to visit! Now, don't go running off, Bourbon! We've got a little job to finish, then we'll get back to you! Remember where you should wait for me? I do! I do! You sure? I can help you, remember? You get me, right? Absolutely! <laughs> I'd never seen a market like this. You could buy almost anything. But Bourbon owed money to the Hansa sentries and was anxious to leave. Holster your weapons at once. Who are you? Come into the light! Slowly, slowly! I'll be damned! Bourbon! Hey guys, we'd better search these two! <laughs> so, you old drunk, what are you carrying this time around? Who's the boy? Look here, boss. I'm sure we can work this out. Sure? Let's go and chat a little. And you keep an eye on this one, huh? Don't move! Stand still, I'm talking to you! Hey, 
Okay, these two may pass. Welcome to the market. Let's move our asses. Or would you like to enjoy their company a little more? Hey, watch your tone. Come on, let me pick up the oh, Jeez Louise. Right in the middle of that tunnel. When I saw if anyone reads me, respond. It's Moscow. Market on the ground station. Yeah. How about some moonshine? So, there's this long tunnel from Sukarev to the nearest inhabited place. The passage is open for residents and local workers only. And the ones who do say there's nothing suspicious about the tunnel itself. There are no side branches. Bullets exchange. Never look at the Kremlin when you are not there. Well, I made an arrangement with the guy here. He's a greedy asshole, but we can't do anything about that. Great, let's go then. I think you already know the way. If anyone reads me, respond. It's possible. We need to get up to the surface. This is Earth, third planet of the solar system. This is an emergency. How do I get up? Bourbon? As if you don't know. I've already paid, Mike. You didn't pay me. But if you don't want to go through... Shit. A pleasure doing business with you. Anyone reads me. All right, all right. It's just kidding. Market underground station. Get ready, everyone. The gate's opening. Are you sure, Commander? Read me. Take your positions. Cover me. Damn. I hate this so much. surface are we very nice when we emerged into the ruins of moscow i felt both fear and sorrow but after a life underground i also saw strange beauty in the dark skies and frozen landscape so that's the dead city grunted bourbon welcome home artyom okay so we're back with a bit more metro <clears throat> Gas mask on. Be careful now. And here we meet a happy citizen. Stalkers. Those crazy devils come to the surface almost every day looking for scrap, ammo, anything they can dig up. Sometimes you find the dead ones frozen stiff, like snowmen in rags. Search the room carefully. You might find another cash here. They often make hideouts for themselves on the surface, just in case. So just take a careful look around, and we'll have no problems with spare filters and ammunition whatsoever. Oh! Jesus. But we <clears throat> that made me jump. What the frick was that? Great. Thanks, friend. Seriously, what on earth was that? Was that like a trap? OK, 
Okay, that was also a trap. Okay, I got a book. All of that for a little book. You taking the pizzle? What about this? What's this? Ah. That's a ammo. Still, that doesn't seem worth it at all. <coughs> Okay. How do we get out of here then? Ready? Let's go. Let's go, let's go. We've got to reach the air shaft, which we'll use to get to dry station. Then we go our separate ways and you'll get my AK like I promised. Okay, bruv. Sounds good. I would like your AK very much. He banging on about. Oh, a dragon. Dragon, dragon. Okay. Definitely will avoid that if possible. Oh, look. Big old whatever that is. Look at it gliding along the floor there. You know what? Um, I feel like maybe I was a bit harsh on this game in the first part of this video. Because yeah, I, I have to give it, the atmosphere is actually very good. Like, the... Oh, the graphics hold up very nice. M for compass. Oh, okay. Oh, I've got like a lighter for some reason. Ah, interesting. I didn't even know that was a thing. How do I put... There we go. Bleh. <coughs> Sorry, I've got something stuck in my throat. Sorry that I keep making weird sounds. Okay, so that was just a loop. What about up here? Ugh, what's that? What was that weird thing? Uh, I like seeing things. Uh. That was that big weird alien thing. else in here? Doesn't seem like it. They're probably down here. Do we go this way or that way? Oh, trying in that way. Doesn't look like we go that way, so probably this way. Oh my jeez. Dragon attacked me. Get me inside. Don't get me inside. Okay. That was interesting. Oh my gas mask is like broken a little bit. See on the corners? Uh, what was I going to do? Oh yeah, I was just going to turn off the... Oh, it is off. Okay, that's fine. I didn't even know you went outside in this game, honestly. I thought it was all um, based inside. Can stop, can stop 
Ooh, spooky kids everywhere. Get them away, get them away. Ugh. Oh. How do I know when I need to swap a filter on my gas mask? That's what I don't understand. Like, I know it's telling me to, but is there anything else? Maybe it's when the world starts going a bit weird looking. Yeah, look at that thing. Okay. Okay, that is scary. Okay, that this is getting better this game now. It was I think it was like a bit um I don't know, it felt like scripted in the tunnels a bit. But now it's getting its own character in the game, if that makes sense. I think that makes sense, what I'm trying to say. Like, you know, at the beginning, I know the game is scripted, like, obviously, but, like, you know what I mean? Like, it, it seems less... It wants you to sort of discover the stuff now, whereas before it was, like, you know... Everything was like a scripted event. Do you think I'd jump over there? Or maybe this way. It's funny, I can hear that guy like shooting, but we just kind of left him on his own. Ooh. Okay, I think... Uh, we might be out there. I wonder how many of those filters I actually have. Maybe this way. Ah, oh, back underground. Interesting. Oh, the dragon. I wonder if I can kill them. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa, it's picked me up. What the hell? Oh, man. Okay, maybe I shouldn't shoot them. Loads of them, look. I think I got... No, I didn't get them. I don't know if I'm just wasting my ammo with these. If maybe... Yeah, I probably don't even need to try killing them, honestly. The question is, where do we go from here, though? Up here? This way. Maybe we can just. Oh. I guess. Don't go in the water, maybe? Yeah, that's not a good idea. Can I jump on this? Okay, so I guess we don't go that way. Oops. That's annoying.
Where on earth do we go? How do I bring up the map again? The compass is C, B. It's got to be this way, I think. Not that way. Sounds like he's over that way. But I don't quite know how to get over there, honestly. through here, did I? Oh. Why is the toilet flashing? I like how I'm just setting off all the traps. Okay. Going deeper underground. Doo -doo -doo. running to. Let's get moving along. Shit. Can you hear this? I hear it, yes. Buggers, aren't they? Oh man, out of ammo. Oh. I got Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball Z. Oh, not again. Come on. Can I sh 
I can't even shoot it. What is happening? Am I dead? Oh, Jesus. What the frick was that? Like seriously, what was that? How was I meant to do anything about that? Shit. Can you hear this? <sighs> Again? Just let him tank them all. I'll just sit at the back and uh, pick off the ones that come to me. Much easier. I'll just stay in this corner. Oh! We go through here. Oh, this way, that way. Oh, come on. Oh. As we I thought I was dead again then. It struck That's good. me that my city was now a foreign and hostile place. I felt safe here, in the darkness of the metro. More so when Bourbon claimed to have friends at Dry Station. Mm -hmm. Listen carefully. The bandits control the station. We need to move quietly and take a look around. If we don't see my friends, we get the hell out of here. Okay. The mushrooms look nice. Nice glowing mushrooms. I remember this great. Let's just. Shit, I can't fit. Okay, you just stay here. Watch that. First in. Last step. Hold it. Who are you? Hey, give me some light. Oh, ha, ha. who do we have here? It's Bourbon the Hopster. Look who's talking. Take me to your boss. I have business with him. The boss? But of course. Uh, the who the boss it is. Uh, where else would you like to go, huh? Uh, okay, that's enough. Or else we'll have to drag him. Move it. We'll finish this later. Move it! I guess his AK is mine now. See if he's forgetting something. I don't see his stuff around. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing but the rats here. Okay, let's go then! Beautiful. Am I meant to be stealthy here, am I? I want me to do this. Just turn off all the lights. What the fuck? Ah, 
Uh, stealth is boring. So, where could it go? Much better. You took him out. I didn't even shoot him. Oh, okay. Okay, two shots. Who's killing everyone? Like, there's loads of them that are just sort of falling over. I'm not doing anything. I don't want to go that way because they're... I shoot? It's not letting me shoot. Seriously, what the frick was that about? Beautiful. Just realized I had my gas mask on all this time. He's dead. Just need ammo more than anything. What did you bring with you, bastard? Answer, Suga, or I will shoot you! What? Who is it? Who is it? My mind! Hippocrate Bourbon, who? Artyom! Who the fuck? Oh dear. Too slow. Why didn't he shoot? Oh, hello. You can keep your weapon down, young man. It's sad, but not unexpected for me for the looks of you. My name is Khan. Well, I suggest that we leave this place immediately. The companions of these bandits will show up soon enough, and I'd prefer to avoid more bloodshed. I'm good. Yeah, that's good. A wise decision. Wise decision indeed. Khan's appearance caught me by surprise. Although while fighting the bandits, I did send someone helping from the shadows. Khan assured me that Bourbon's fate was not tied to my own. But I regretted his death. I didn't. I didn't really care for him. Where are we now? Nobody ever walks here. Neither people nor beasts. Even the rats are absent. Okay, so in other words, you don't have to be scared because there's nothing here. Correct? They know we are here. Come closer to the tubes and listen. Just don't stay for too long. Yes. 
Very good. Some say it's the voice of the tunnels. Others consider it to be a form of psychic influence. I know this tunnel, and it knows me. Very good. Let's move. Let's move. Be careful here. This is a dangerous tunnel. Please keep your light on, my friend. Or else you may stay here forever. Okay. Flip, we need to go around. I don't think the world is about to go to What? Be careful here. This is okay. Please keep your light on, my friend. Or else we might we need to go out. Touch the silhouettes. I don't think I go. How do I go around it? Pretty cool, though. Good idea. Mom, where are you? How do I? Can I burn them? Ah, look at that. Oh, there is a silhouette there. Hi. Okay, let's try again. Be careful here. This is a dangerous tunnel. Please keep your light on, my friend. Come on. She was moved. Be careful here. This is a dangerous time. Oh, come on. Please keep your light on, my friend, or else we might stay. We need to go around. Don't touch the silhouettes. I don't think the world is applicable here. Now? Okay, perfect. Next. Now what? Any more silhouettes? Oh, it's like a ghost train. Oh, okay, that's cool. I like that. That's really cool. Okay, this game is getting good. It's got some annoying factors to it, but overall, it is getting better, like more creepy. Oh. There's a lot in there, like a whole army of people, see? Maybe I'll turn up the gamma just a little bit for you because I don't know if you can actually uh, see what I see. Let's try this. Maybe you can see them a bit better now. stations. Follow me, but remain at my back. Okay, go on then. Astonella, Pio, Asterion, Manto, 
kas to ne labio es tiedīju man to alum ram un alum ram un kas to ne labio es tiedīju man to kas to ne labio es tiedīju alum ram un alum ram un kas to ne labio es tiedīju man to nice oh played sir Mushrooms. Rats and a skull. Something growling around here somewhere. Oh, what was that? Let him handle it. Damn, this I think I ruined the shock value there because I kind of saw through the door, like that body, before it actually fell out at me. Let's go. This way. Train coming. No? What is that? It's much easier to let him handle everything, honestly. Uh -oh. oh, I'm totally out of ammo. Yeah, 
I need picking up ammo for shop, which I haven't got. Okay. So I definitely need ammo, please. Stay put. There's no need to interfere. It's like, I like this game, but there's some things I just don't like about it. I, I don't know. I'm just not fully immersed into it, you know? But for, for the time it came out, it's... Do you really suppose that Polis will help you? Or is there simply nothing else left to believe? You don't have to answer. survival. The station is under attack again. Let's go, lad. The defenders could use some help. Hey, demo. Khan, over here! Mm. Oh, shit. There we go, that's the stuff. Another attack? Yes, they both with the outer defenses. All the survivors are here. Adal will live to see another day. Where do the monsters come from? As always, from the left tunnel and from the crossing. We sent the demolition Jesus. squad there, but they never came back. And there is no one else we could send. You are eager to avert your station's doom, Artyom, are you not? And here the doom has already arrived. We must help. Find the remains of the demo squad. They had a bomb. Move it into the left tunnel as far as you can, then run for it. <laughs> The explosion will be massive. As for the crossing, it's already been buried once, but looks like the Nosalises have dug through the cave-in. There was an airlock close by. It must have been left open. Try locking or collapsing it. I'll stay here with the survivors. Try luring the monsters towards us if there are too many. Okay, so I need a bomb. Is this bomb then? Through here? What the frick is that? Oh, because there's those silhouette things there. Exactly, am I looking for like a bomb down here? You said plant the bomb in the left tunnel, but where? Where do I get the bomb? Oh, it's still there. Maybe 
the bomb is in the other tunnel. Ah, here. Okay, got the bomb, now back to the tunnel. Boom, baby. have to kill them all. Why is this visa just looking at me? What's happening? Melee is absolutely useless in this game. I don't even know why they bother putting melee in, it just doesn't seem to do anything. Apart from maybe against humans or something. Keep coming or something? This is a bit weird. I don't know what I'm meant to do. Oh Jesus! Increase it. 
find a way to close the airlock. Put your freaking map down. Okay, let's try this again. Can't go through here. Probably not. So they're just going to keep spawning from there. Can't seem to go through there. So maybe something more here I'm missing? I've got no freaking idea. About where the bomb went off. Seriously, what on earth am I meant to do here? Why can't I go through here? That's what I don't understand.
change your name minute describe the situation find a way to close the airlock That's weird, the arrow is pointing up here. What's that? Oh, these bombs. Oh, okay. I would have never found that. A big war at a small station was won. I won't be going further with you. I'm still needed here. The tunnels have collapsed. If you okay, you stay there then. Hopefully these cursed people let me through now. Maybe he'll do his prayer thing and let me through. They are building a new society, complete with all the lovely police state bonuses, like people informing on their neighbors. The smithy look for an acquaintance of mine. Andrew, the blacksmith. Mention my name. He'll give you a hand. That's it? You didn't even have to do the prayer. Oh look, there's like... It's a remembrance. A shrine to hope. Even in these times. We can't relinquish the things that make us human. See you later. That's it. Get in. Remember, everything depends on you and you alone. Until we meet again. Goodbye, Artyom. Armory Station was where most of the weapons in the metro were made. There had been an arms factory located above, and after the nukes fell, Many of the workers settled here. I was looking for Andrew the Smith, but he found me first. The graphics are nice in this game, to be fair. We've got the atmosphere spot on. I think it's mostly just the combat and sort of the scripted events that they're they're not bad, but they're just who goes there? Stand still. A bit aged. It's a human. Kill the light already. Well, you look human. <laughs> That's all that counts. Come in. This is a free station. Thank you. It's like got the similar vibes to like Fallout and stuff like that. Careful, kid. Our free station is under the watchful eye of the Reds. Paranoia is the new game in town. Attention! Attention! Document inspection is currently being carried out at the armory. Please stay at your registered residences and assist the law enforcement. 
reinforcement personnel in their work. Race to the wall. Be vigilant, comrades. The enemy never sleeps. Hey, come on. Quit harassing me. I don't swing that way. Get lost. <laughs> Go to hell. Got the bolt yet. Prepare for inspection. Oh, I'm always Shot. prepared for Go this. Hush. Hush. And who are you? The comedian's boyfriend. Put your hands out. You're under arrest. What? All right, all right. Lay off. I'll come quietly. Run! Oh, that's a good, good start. Let's get them! Come on, follow me! Go, go! Here! was that? It's like to the left, went left, dead end. Oh come on, all the... again. And who are you? The comedian's boyfriend! Put your hands out! You're under arrest. Alright, alright! Lay off! I'll come quietly. Run! I'm gonna kill him. Go! Let's get them! Come on, follow me! Go! I'm coming, I'm coming. Here! Get down! Get down, Billy. Get to the chopper. Seriously, what? I, I don't. I'm always hurt. The gout on your body. Come on, no. Did you check my prostate while you're at it? Shh. Hush. And who are you? The comedian's boyfriend. Put your hands out. You're under arrest. All right, all right. Lay off. I'll come quietly. Run! Okay, let's try this again, go. shall we? Let's get them! Come on, follow me! Go, go! Here! God left in our world. That day, he was with me. I had been rescued by Han's friend, Andrew the blacksmith. He would prove to be my ticket out of the communist station. But the only way goes through a goddamn battlefield, the front line between the Reich and the Reds. You'll need a disguise. Take these overalls, put them over your clothes. The Reds are rounding up the volunteers to storm the Nazi fortifications. They're about to send a train full of new recruits straight into the fire. But you will be riding the train unannounced. Your seat won't be first class, but you don't have to pay the fare with your own blood either. <laughs> Once the troop train has passed the roadblocks, you're on your own. Watch out there. Security is like a seal. 
The station is crawling with the enemy spies, plotting terrorist acts. There's a saboteur lurking in every alley. I so I think I was kind of spoiled, probably, with everything you need when traveling in dangerous areas. No. Um. Great link. Come, look, try and buy. Customize. Sniping, laser spire, chance of you to achieve, whatever. Um, yeah, I think I was spoiled by playing Titanfall 2 recently. Come on, jump into the hole up to And also Okay, I'm in the hole. Now what? And also Wolfenstein, because although Wolfenstein was like kind of no. It was cheesy but in a good way because there is just so much action. This, I think, would have been like a really, like a masterpiece of a game back in the day when it first came out. Um, graphics still hold up very nicely, but... You see the luggage hold? Get into it. But the, the combat and everything just doesn't hit very well anymore. And also, it, it's like the game doesn't know its identity entirely. Like, story-wise, it's telling a decent story and it's got the atmosphere and the aesthetic and environment, like, really, really well done. But it doesn't know if it wants to be, like, an action game or a horror game. And it's, like... It, it's not even in the middle, it's just that it's doing both sides of it pretty pretty badly, in my opinion. Like, I'm not getting any jump scares. The only jump scare I got is when I went through that trap so far. And the action just feels like really, I don't know. Doesn't, uh, I don't know. It's, it's hard, because I, I like the story. I like the aesthetic and everything, but yeah, just not sold on the actual combat side of it, especially with these like scripted events where you have to wait for the like the monsters to come at you and stuff. But you know, that is just a case of I've been spoiled by too many other games similar to this that have done it obviously a lot better because this they've been newer and they've had chance to perfect that sort of stuff but yeah I just thought I'd let you know like my feelings on it so far what I've got but I would assume the books are probably a lot more interesting probably but I will try Metro Exodus afterwards or last light whichever one comes next just to see because now that I've started I want to finish it just to say that I can not give up halfway through but so far the best part is when we went up to the surface with that guy and we saw those dragons it was more open and the combat felt a lot better there as well but yeah I don't know it's, uh, it's a difficult one
Is it also your tradition to like the whole thing with the elect the phenomenons or whatever they call those little sparks of electricity? That's interesting. And the, the silhouettes is cool, and the, the monsters are okay, but they they just feel very clumsy. And yeah, like even when I compare them to like Half Life monsters, I would say they were also like clumsy or they are clumsy in this day and age but I think the Half-Life monsters were more satisfying to fight against even the apocalypse didn't stop us from killing one another over ideology I was about to go through the front line between the Nazis and the communists I've heard they once fought another war that the Nazis lost funny though just literally plowing through the wall like taking them down one by one congratulations on your arrival to the front lines I Get all the ammo. Damn. And that's the, the other thing with the stealth. They honestly. They didn't need stealth in this game at all. It, it's just not needed. So I, I think they just put stealth in for the hell of it, you know? Yeah. 
Just trying to save ammo there, really, but didn't seem to work. Oh, for God's sake, not all again. Come on. I know you will make our motherland proud. The future of Lenin's metro and the future of mankind. Who the hell is there? Anyone around? See, when there's like mass amounts of enemies, it's actually a pretty fun game like this. Like, I think they sh mm, I don't know. It's like, I really like the level of action, like combat. It, f it just feels like a lot, lot better. Whereas the horror or the monsters themselves, they just feel so clumsy and boring to fight against, you know? Are you sleeping? Yes. No idea how you'd sleep through all that, but, you know. Hmm. I'm not sure how to get through that. that I miss somewhere I guess if that's it what's that binoculars oh night vision okay Your leader has abandoned you. See you. 
Jeez Louise. That shotgun's good. How you avoid this thing? Okay. Can not drive that? No. Good, not good.
on there as well. See, this combat is actually really fun and intense. Yes, the enemies are a little bit clumsy, like they build up and just let you plow them down, but overall, pretty nice. And maybe there is a way to do this in stealth, but as I said before, stealth in this kind of game is just not fun. It, we're out. senses I lost all hope Nazi prisoners were used for slave labor or target practice nice why should we hesitate let's shoot this red spy and be done with it shouldn't we call the Gestapo It'll take him forever to get here from Reich. Who'll watch this pig till then? Why have they got Arabic on there? The Nazis somehow became Arabic? Good point. All right, you red scum. Offer a prayer to your Marx or whoever. <laughs> you look like US. Maybe if you beg, you'll think about killing me quickly. Okay, that was totally unnecessarily over the top and very slow. They could have easily killed me very much faster than that. I, I get it if he was interrogating me or something, but he literally had a gun to my head and was about to shoot me. You know, one thing I like about the bad guys, there's always a lot of discussion before they get around to pulling the trigger. So these are... Reds or Ukrainian? I can't tell. Or what? Nazis? You owe me one, kid. You don't look like a red. Who the hell are you? That's Hunter's token. I'd better take you to Miller. Whatever message you have, save it for him. Okay, let's move to the armored car. Let's not move to the armored car because I'm going to take a break. So thank you very much. Um, I will probably carry on i don't know maybe i'll carry on i'm kind of enjoying this game and i'm kind of not i'm like i'm very midway i'm like halfway between enjoying it and not but i kind of do want to continue just to see where it leads and because it will build up to the next game which will hopefully be a bit more enjoyable but um yeah it is what it is so yeah be right back let's move to hello, the hello i am back it is me, it is Sean. Okay, Pavel, here. here's the plan. You'll take him in the armored car to our real car. After that, we'll be real close. Just the hall and the black station. And what about the mission? Hey, Miller will hand you a medal if you bring news from Hunter. I'll handle the mission myself. Let's meet up at the black station. You be careful out there. It's funny, every time I take a break from this game, part of me wants to come back and play it. Very soon. You should man the turret. It'll be harder to see you that way. I hope you know how to operate a machine gun, kid. Well, guys, good luck to you. Okay, I'm taking the turret, I guess. Hmm. 
Okay. Ah, oh, okay. So you don't move it. You only move it up and down. And keyboard. You try to get past the roadblocks quietly. Keep your cool, and they might overlook the fact that we're standing in for the crew. If it all goes to hell, just do as I say. That's annoying that they've they've added like A and D to move it left and right, but up and down on the mouse. It's like why not just put it all on the mouse? It's not Arabic. Look, it's R for right, probably. It just looked like Arabic when I first uh, saw it. Am I going to plow through all these or what? What are you doing out here? This vehicle, it's not on the transport schedule. Uh, we've been sent to the forward roadblock, Herr officer, to deliver the ammo. They've already received the ammo shipment. Who are you? Raise your eye shield. Stop! Alert! Men your vehicles! Uh oh. down. They'll be now just in front. There'll be one coming out of here probably. Yep. anyone. Freaking light is too bright. What's going on? Can I not get rid of that? Gosh, there's so many of them. Overheated. Can't shoot. Oh, fine. intense. with the humans is just so good compared to the action with the uh, mutants. Gosh, a 
a lot of damage. See, this is like Wolfenstein level of action. door guns before we go out. That's the same gun I think, no? That one's only got 25 bullets though. The other one had more. 54. Is the way I came. <laughs> so like a weird test tube in his mouth. It's random. After our firefight with the Nazi trolleys, it seemed we would have an easy road ahead. Once again, I was wrong. Almost there. Omen should be waiting at the Black Station. Chasing me. Bonjour. Thank God they didn't have a rail car, or they'd get us in this tunnel. What was that? 
Oh, mutant thing. Like a ghost train a bit, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Now it's like a ghost train. Ooh, yeah. You know that way it takes you like right up to the ghost or the ghoul and then at the last second it like turns away sort of thing. Reminds me of that. Pretty cool. The game is getting better though. Like, I think it, it's just like you need to get used to it, I guess. Like, because, you know, when you've been spoiled with a lot of the newer games with newer mechanics and stuff. I've heard so much about it. So that's what it looks like. It's like train graveyard. There's lots of mutant things jumping around everywhere. Whoa, what was that? pretty fast so these things catch up looks like I set up a trap just gonna run through here super fast just in case there's traps Lots of ammo for this guns. All right. Although I just don't understand where I might go. Because that is a dead end. Nope. 
Mm -hmm. Through the pipe? Ah. Did not expect that, honestly. So we've got some traps here. Uh, question is... Sorry, one second, just... There we go. Let's avoid them. Human, but how? Come here, quick! Oh, they're you friendly. You see a man in those towns. Talk to the captain. We're in deep shit. And now, so are you. How do I... Where's the captain? I don't know what the hell you're doing out here. But an extra gunman's always handy. The passage to the station is closed off until the evacuation is complete. Prepare for battle. Take whatever spare ammo is left in the stash. How many of them uh, have you seen? Of us now. Ten? Twenty? Our squad is no, called the Children of the Underground. But think of your loved ones back in the station. Any beast that gets through our line will show them no mercy. So lock and load, and let's teach these freaks how real men fight. Can you feel it? Shit! Put up the light! Stay calm! Stay at the back. Hopefully they'll be missed the work. Dragunis dayot sanar gorde varet pasadin to nirlaya. Here they come. Oh, they take some killing, don't they? Try and preserve as much ammo as possible. So let them handle what they can. And I'll just finish off the stragglers. Doing perfectly fine, they don't even need me. Oh, oh, he's coming from there. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry, guys, 
because you got this. I believe in you. Oh, not that one. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. broke through. Polis must be warned. But my fighting days are over, as you can see. I have a critical mission for you. Go up to our radio beacon. Contact Polis and broadcast the emergency message I have prepared. <laughs> Good luck, brother. Okay. One month more ammo, but okay. Also, why was no one on that gun? Or maybe there was. Maybe I didn't realise. Can I ride this? No, of course not. to go, where to go, up, 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 up. Gosh, she was fast. like a rail gun or something. What do we have here? Okay. Where do I go? Up. 
This way? Kill, that's nice. It would be nice if I knew where I was going though. As soon as you turn away, they jump on your back. On your ass. And these guys just keep on coming. That's the armory. Maybe through here. Or is this the way I came? I can't remember, honestly. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Crying child, don't like that. Uncle! Uncle, come on, get up! We'll get eaten! Please, wake up! Why are you sleeping? Let's go to mom. You told me you'd take me to... Go away. Leave me alone. Mom told me not to talk to strangers. Mm -hmm. Please, uncle. Are you hurt? Say something. He won't wake up. I think he's dead. He's dead, isn't he? Have... You'll take me? I don't know you, but if I don't, I guess I'll get eaten by the monsters. That kid is far too positive. You have a gun? Okay, maybe I'll come with you then. You can shoot the monsters, right? Yeah, that kid is... Something wrong with that kid. 
Okay. My name is Sasha. You shoot, and I'll watch your back. I don't want that psychopath kid watching my back. Here. I was visiting Uncle. He was taking me home when the monsters came. They jumped at him. He started shooting, but the bear! Oh. Oh my god, the stupid holes. The holes in this game are just annoying. Like he was taking me home when the monsters came. Not, they jumped at him. He started shooting, but then a big no sound. They're not even a good the part of the game. They're just I was like really scared. Oh my god. Oh my Taking me home when the monsters came. They jumped at him. He started shooting, but they Oh, shut no up, sales. you annoying little but uncle is real there. Oh, I missed. Okay. So there's 50 million holes. And all the pigs are dead. Ow. Just spat something at me. Or it was just that one from behind. my flashlight on there's this annoying kid he's like attached to my back or something i have a gun too it's in a safe place till i'm old enough to shoot but you can borrow it when your gun wears out thank you hey there's one crawling from the back oh no problem hey we'll there's just, one crawling from the back we'll just run it's fine hey look out there's a hole people yeah. should not grenades in here. Mom said the ceiling is weak and could come crashing down. Okay. Hey, what's that? Look. It's a bomb. It's fine, don't worry. Okay. Are we really leaving the station? Cool. I've never been to the tunnels before. Mom says there's a scary place where the... Wow. What's that up there? Wait. Uncle showed me a picture once. The s sky. That's the sky, isn't it? It's like oh my God, a this kid. ceiling. I'll be famous. I saw the sky. Seriously, this kid is very terrifying. More so than any of the mutants. Do you think we can climb all the way to the sky? Uh, I don't really I am tempted to, to drop high. you don't if you keep talking. Me. Let me through, let me, I, I want to get away from this kid. Thank you for saving my son. I can never repay you. But uh, take these cartridges, at least it's something. Thanks. Um, yeah, stop All looking right, at me like that, go. please. Okay. An old keyboard there. Bullets oh, change. Jesus. I don't want to exchange You're bullets. Welcome. Special offers, uh, discounts. 
I'm going to upgrade that gun though if I can. That one with the freaking nails. Customize. Misc optics. That air bottle fit with the helmet does not leak out even when over pressure. Laser sight. Let's just do that. I'll do. Come through. I think this game was probably when it first came out it was like on the level of when half-life the original half-life came out you know it was epic it was so like different and new and nothing they ever been done like it before i think that's what this game was at the time i went up again to the gloomy charm of post-apocalyptic moscow I was warned in Hull Station about a new squad of Nazi Rangers on the surface, but I meant to fulfill- oh, I didn't realise there was more. So I think this game will have like a massive following and fan base of people who played it back in the day and who maybe have these like, you know, epic memories. Oh. Do they know I'm here, do they? Or are they shooting the bats? No, they know I'm here. Um, I was going to try and hide somewhere, but... Okay, let's try that again. Because I was going to try and hide, but... Uh, yeah. Let's try this again. God's sake, like seriously? I don't know if I'm just meant to stealth them. Let's just let them all hopefully approach me. in the dick. Take that.
many and they're just too annoying. You know what's really annoying is the lens flares, the lights like shining at you. They really disorientate you. Like look how bright that freaking light is. I, mean, I can probably shoot it, but there's also the, the freaking sun lens flare is like too much. Okay. Good. That's what I'll where is it like up here? Can I climb up this rope? Nope. There's a ladder. Oh, which apparently I can't even use properly. Oh there's stairs there. Is that the way I came or what? I'm stuck on the ladder. I literally cannot move.
Maybe out here. Ah, maybe here. Where I was before, I think. So I don't want to be there. Okay, going down again. I would assume it would be in this house, honestly. get on the roof, I just don't know where to go. make it very obvious on where you need to go, do they? There's no way back underground here, no? Nope. Can't get through there. What does the map say? helpful at all. Ah, didn't go up here before. Did we or did we? Hmm, can't go that way. It's got to be something with that, I think. Uh, maybe not. What about you down here? Nothing. What about in here? Oh, and a radiation there. Dragon flying about. A crane is literally just there so you can get into this window, I think. Oh, 
I would die if I jumped out of that. Oh, ladder here. Is there in this? Oh, this is the ladder we've got to start. Very nice back, I think. The only annoying thing with those throwing knives is they take so freaking long to like actually throw. They're not instant like in Call of Duty or something like that. Proper long wind up time. Okay, um can't see anywhere to go honestly. Let's we go outside. Miss like I, I threw like four knives and didn't hit any of them. Let's try that again. Too soon. Hold your fire! Anybody hurt? No? Okay, let's go then. Oh, they're not one shot kill these things. Dragon 
help me. Shooting the dragon. That's good. Just let them come to that. Let's just run for it. There we go. It was clear that Black Station was occupied by fascists. But Olin had said he'd wait for me there. I had to risk it. Had to risk it indeed. Okay, that's been another hour. Oh, here they are again. Just in time. <laughs> what took you so long? Where's Pavel? Did he... Alright, later. Pavel is dead, my dude. Course. Nazis literally flooded the station. They'll have to act alone. Sorry. But if you can shut down their generator, it'll be easier to sneak past the guards. Take this. That's I will wait for you in the deserted weapon. tunnel, the police. Okay, cool. So, that is where I'm going to leave it. Okay, I'm back. It is Sharpie Piss Potato. We are back with this dude. And we're finishing Metro, hopefully. Because... Honestly. What took you so long? Where's Pavel? Did he... All right. Later. The situation got worse. Nazis literally flooded the station. He'll have to act alone. Sorry. But if you can shut down their generator, it'll be easier to sneak past the guards. Take this. I will wait for you in the deserted tunnel, the polis. Uh, science, okay. Okay, let's replace the... Actually, no, I don't want to replace my nail gun. We're just going in full guns blazing. Okay, so there's cans. Let's avoid the cans. There's a trip wire. Let's jump over that. Memory. They missed the car. Yours? I don't know. Um, hey, the fuck? Oh, that's not a silencer. I thought that was a silencer on the end of this gun. I guess not. That? Who's swinging stuff? Okay, well, we've got some. Are those silenced guns, maybe? Who knows? 
There's a throwing knife. I can use that as a silenced weapon. ammo on that gun. I need this one. Give me your gun. Hopefully it's a silenced gun. Oh, it's not. It's a... Uh, it's a shotgun. Oh, I've just alerted everyone. Oh, well. Too late now. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Run, run, run. Okay, that went smooth as butter. We're good. I really wish I'd had a silenced gun though. No matter, we'll take this. Danger! Go company! Back in sheep! Where from? Why would I just <laughs> Oh, I keep pushing C to crouch, but... Uh, but I'm quickly realizing that C is not crouch. Maybe this gun is silenced. I think it's a bit late for silenced guns now, but whatever. Yeah, definitely a bit late for silenced guns. Now, come here, you're not born! Who's shouting? Oh my god. Okay, it sounded like there was one more around. At least. Why can't I shoot out that light? There we go. Okay, maybe that's it. point in stealth. It's so much more exciting when you're not stealthing about. See? Much better. Dealt with them effectively. And they're all gone. Bang. And the dirt is gone. Where am I going though? That's a good question. That's where I came. Nice. Some tools. Some spiders. Oh. Down in the hole. I am a mole and I live in a hole. Uh, no. Oh, okay. Whoa, what was that? What? Oh, he's running out of gas. Have I got a gas mask on? Yeah. How do I. I've totally forgot. Oh, uh, it was M. M for m whoa. M for mighty explosions. What is that? It sounds like an elephant. Burn, baby, burn! All these spiders go away. Oh, so many spiders to burn. Burn, burn, burn. <laughs> 
Burn. I am the burninator. Whoa, look at them. See, that was cool. Whoa, there's a spider on my screen. Incy wincy spider. Also. My man. Oh. Here, you climb in here and rest. Rest, yeah, good one. We'll reach Polis soon. That's how we got to Polis. It does a very nice place. Mutant creatures. This is something else. Something much worse. See, this bit's interesting. I like when they do this. It's like different. Do I run away? No. Even children, even children hated by their parents try to love and understand them. We wish to understand, we wish to understand you and help you. and help you. Okay, interesting. Mr. Slender Man. Mr. Slender. Oh, Wicked nice. phenomenon, yes. But, you know, it's not any more evil than, say, fire. It all depends on your point of view. Try to get a better understanding of things before you make your judgment. Let's move out now. It's not safe here. Okay. It's hard to describe my feelings at that moment. Exhausted, yes, but joyful. I had made it. Once I delivered Hunter's message, the rescue of my home station could be decided by those stronger and wiser than I. Okay. And my task. Hey, you at the rail car! Stop the engine! Do not Stop move! Shining. Name Stop. yourselves! Oh, we're Nazis! Come here to take your station! Well, man, <laughs> is that you? You're lucky Petrovich isn't here. He's not a man for jokes. Who's that with you? He's from the northern frontier. I'm escorting him from the black station. All right, come on through. Come on through, Mr. Sandman. The mere dream, boo 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 boo. Carrot tank bunker thing. Oh, it's like a mobile bunker, I think. See, they add this music like this is meant to be like spectacular here, but to me, it, it's just another station. Like, I don't know. Like, okay, this station is more impressive than the others, but still, it's not like a wow moment, is it really? Gosh, I'm negative tonight. I'm sorry, everyone. Just call me Negative Nancy. I'll try and find positives. Let's focus on the positives. Positive, we're exiting the rail car. Negative, we need to wait for all this talking and role play. Come on. Say something. Welcome to Polis, Captain Krasnov. <laughs> You've come a long way, young man. Where exactly are you from? Black <laughs> Station. Oh. What? Can't he speak for himself? No. Look, Captain. It's the kid's first time in Polis. He's been through hell getting here, and he's carrying Hunter's message to Miller. So cut him some slack, huh? All right, all right. Get changed. There's the clothes. You can leave your gear. It'll be safe here. You'll get it back sparkling clean. Come you go ahead and take some rest, and Artyom, and I'll go find Miller. I hope he's not out of the By the way, don't forget to scrub yourself down in the lobby, old man. I won't, I won't. <laughs> you pain in the ass. Would you rather have two-headed kids? <laughs> Idiot. Hello! Hello. Oh. 
don't know. I don't have a clue what I'm doing here. I'm just clicking stuff. Okay, that'll do. Too late. Now you have to wait. Why do I change my clothes? You won't find better rates in the whole metro. Um, Whatever. Better rates. Where are my clothes? They're definitely Special offers and discounts. They're telling me to change my clothes, but I can't click anything. What is it? Need ammo? Ask me. Sir, report. This means. Artyom, I'm me. What is the message from Hunter? This way. Well, thank you for bringing this to Polis. Was a brave thing you did. I'll call an emergency session. When they summon you, you'll report the situation. All council members, please assemble in the council chamber. I repeat, all council members, please proceed to the council chamber. Escort the boy to the council chamber. See, that's quite cool. That's that's nice. That looks it's like nicely designed. You've got a little river and stuff. You've got a little bar. See, more stuff like that would be good, honestly. Like guy fishing. It's like got some character to it, some uniqueness, and this as well, like little science lab and stuff. It like reminds me of Half Life. You know where you can openly explore and like you can see other stories happening around you that's that's what you need like even this like kid drawing stuff well this guy let me in already Jeez. i'll add it skip time unbelievable artum I'm stunned that the council has refused to help your station. I'm, I'm ashamed that they lack the courage you have already shown. But Polis is not the whole metro. There still are people who will rise up and fight the threat of the Dark Ones. Okay, 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 okay. Listen carefully. The Rangers have found several well-preserved missile bases near the city. Some could probably be activated and deliver a missile strike against the Dark Ones. The problem is that the missiles are supposed to be launched from the command center, D6. But we don't know where that is, or if it's operational. However, we do know where that information can be found. There's a huge library on the surface. Dangerous place, but it contains a secret military archive. We must go there. Okay, we'll split up now to avoid the tension. You'll go up from here. I've already arranged that. When you've made your way to the library entrance, I'll be there waiting for you. Okay? Yeah. Hey, Artyom, be careful. Yes, I will. Ah, one more thing. He slapped me out of here. Back, we'll head straight for Sparta base. My rangers will meet us there. Okay, cool. Oh, up, up to the station, whatever. The council's decision shocked me. But Miller's so plan gave me hope. Once more, I climbed up to the bones of Moscow to search for the secret of D6 and a way to awaken the horde. Of okay, missiles. let's awaken those horde missiles. Let's do it. Oh, I just went up here, but let's go up again. Cool. Okay, we're on top side. <coughs> There's a dragon, probably. I need gas mask before I die. Okay. What? Oh, I've got a new gas mask. Okay. Um. Also, another thing that annoys me, just a slight peeve, is the footsteps. They sound like really weird and slow as well. Like the movement is just slow in this game. I don't know if they'll follow me down here. Like, 
Okay, no. Nope. Uh, see, now that, that's good. Laughing children in the sewers, that's kind of scary. I'm not a fan of that. So good job, game. You've actually freaked me out a bit. Okay, there's a trap there. Let's set it off and run. Oh. Okay, I did the set off. I didn't run. Not a problem. Where's the corpse? I thought there was going to be something there. Can't get through there, no. Up here then, I guess. Right. You're shooting stuff. There's a dragon out here, let me in. Can you let me in? There's obviously someone in there shooting. Let me in. Right in here. Made me jump only because the freaking grass was there and I couldn't see anything. Oh, don't tell me I have to fight all these. And a dragon. They take too many shots to kill. Reload time takes too freaking long. Seriously. I'm sorry, but... Oh, seriously, these things... See, this is the kind of stuff that annoys me. Two guys show up, they're shooting and helping me, but not saying a word. Form a circle. Oh, okay, form a circle. It's just little things like that. I really need to stop being so negative. He's the line. Oh, what line? Oh, I'm holding this side, am I? Surely it would be better if we could actually, you know, see in each other's vision rather than being on opposite sides and outnumbered. What do I know? Oh, of course. combat it's just always exactly the same you know it just there's no variety to it same enemies like rinse and repeat sorry negative again 
We need to get to the military archives. It is somewhere beneath the main library. Now, we can reach it through the main reading hall, all right? Now freezing here. Let's go. Can I get through here now or something? Seriously, that's so annoying. So that door, he's just going to open it without a key. Yeah. Why couldn't I do that? Why did I have to wait? Let's go, guys. Shoot them, just get inside. Oh. Okay, that was stupid. I don't even know. I'm just leaving him. These guys are obviously special. Special ops. But the wrong kind of special. What are these things? Like big old phalluses in the ceiling. Good old ceiling phalluses. <laughs> what the frick? Am I getting attacked by the phalluses? Oh, that thing that was meant to be that was meant to be a jump scare, I think. I'm stuck, so you guys are on your own. I wish this door would open. Uh, come on, come on. No, I'm actually stuck. I can't get out. Can okay, no. I? No, I'm, I'm actually stuck. I can't see anywhere else to go. Have I broken the game? Can you, someone please open the door? These are just lame versions of the head crabs from not head crabs, the in Half-Life there was those sucker things on the ceiling and they used to if you touched them they'd suck you up into the ceiling. They were cool. These things are just hanging phalluses. And I'm stuck. Let's see, am I gonna wait? Okay, great. But I'm also stuck in here. That was really not obvious that I had to do that at the beginning. Okay, it was then because it was Don't flashing. Go anywhere. We'll come for you on our way back. <laughs> it's Jack. Oh my god, these guys. Any longer, those beasts will have flipped us apart. We want to. do here shoot something through here maybe so see these guys are absolutely special on another level why 
where would you go next to a window? Come on, you absolute plebs. Just do something. Open the door. Like, I can't see anything to shoot there at all. I can see a gun there flashing. That door won't open. That, nothing there. Nothing there. Dragon outside. Nothing here. This guy's doing that. Nothing there. This is locked. This is locked. I'm running out of filters. So what? I just shoot this door open or something? Oh my god. Why would... Why didn't it tell me I could do that? Like, why does it leave you to figure this stuff out? It's like they're trying to make it into like an adventure game now or something where you need to figure out puzzles on your own that you've not been told about at all. It's locked. Then, what, dragon will come in or something? Need to find a key on someone? What, what is that? Okay, so it's now turning into like Tomb Raider or something. Nice. This game has like an identity crisis. It doesn't know if it wants to be like a first person shooter, a stealth game, a horror game, or an adventure game. It's trying to be all at the same time and it and these they're moving so slowly. Just Please. Jolty bucket, will it ever end? Okay, so this is a boss room. Oh, it will just be a room where we need to fight off loads of hordes, probably. I was alone again, and soon I would look into the eyes of fear, literally. Okay, what just happened? And why is that thing there? Okay, so this is cool. It's like, oh, I was going to say it was turning into like a chase or something. I, I, I thought it didn't want me to kill that thing. It just wants me to run away from it or something. Which is cool. You know, chases are cool. Like, that's cool. You know, it's like adrenaline, trying to figure out where to go. And now I'm running after it. Need to fall down. Oh no, that just takes me back down again, so I need to probably head up and stay up, I guess. 
But that thing can probably jump up as well, I imagine. Yeah, look. It's not very scary, is it? It just sort of like hits you once and then that's it. Maybe you might play it on like hard mode where it does more damage or something. that animation okay out of everything so far that was probably the most scary it's been it's still going on apparently but do I have to kill this one no the underground depository was a frightening place and I had no idea where or what to search but I refused to think that all my efforts would come to nothing Okay, it's still about two of them. But it just seems weird that you just have to like outrun them and not fight them a bit. You know? It's like a strange, strange decision. It would be cool if you would need to like, you know, get them to run into traps and kill themselves or something, not just run from them. I don't have a clue where I'm going by the way, I'm just I'm just running. Running fast, running hard. Uh don't know where I go from here though. It's kinda like a dead end. Can't get in that tube. Oh, fell back down. I'm going here. Weird, like what am I looking for here exactly? Like, because I don't know if I need to just waste my ammo trying to kill that gorilla dude or. If I just need to figure out where to run away from him from. Ah, here probably. Ooh, what's that? Oh, okay. See, I think there, there was another game that came out, uh, Oh, he's sleeping. Uh, before this, which was Doom 3, I think. Now, they absolutely nailed. Maybe Doom 3 didn't come out before it. I think it did, but I could be wrong. But Doom 3 nailed the freaking horror aspect of the game, like, big time. They absolutely owned it, you know? Like, that game was scary to play at least for me whereas this like you know 
games scare me a lot. Like uh, the Evil Within, that that still scares me a lot. That game when I tried to play that. But um, but um, yeah, this game I don't know. There's just, it's just the horror aspect just isn't there. If it makes sense, it's just kind of like. Like, okay, I've just closed the door on the bad guy, and that's it. Nah, I don't know. It's just... It's just lacking. Like, I think they should have focused more on less enemies, but bigger jumps, bigger scares, make it more like a, a freaking horror. And if you have loads of enemies, make it into an unwinnable battle that you need to run or trick them or do something, but not, I don't know. Oh, and this, this seems a bit over the top as well. Like, do we really need to see you search every single drawer to find it? Now, monster will be there and he'll attack us, and then probably that guy will come and save us again. I had found the D6 documents, but Miller had not yet returned. Without his help, I wasn't certain I could get out of the library alive. But everything depended on it. More gorillas to run away from. That American you geezer. Doing, I'll take you there for 50 bullets. No. So you made it, Arturo. I had my doubts, to be honest. Did you find anything? Okay, saddle up. Pacone, Brivetta. So, uh, where are we going? To church. Arturo, does the name Ken ring the bell? He helped us find you. I still don't know how you did it. As long as it's co not copyrighted, or I mean, yeah, royalty free music, that's fine. put in charge of radio monitoring. Our hope was to contact the government bunkers over the Urals, but those bunkers were the first to be hit. At first, they didn't directly target civilians. I tell him. I'm Vladimir. Speak whatever you like. As I was monitoring the radio, Thank you, I will. Hey there, Artyom. That's the other thing in this game. I'm generally not interested in what anyone has to say because it's all been so boring. Okay, okay, okay. There's not much useful in here. Just hints at most. Although it does show the way to D6. Well, that's our destination then. Are you ready? Yep. So, how are we faring? Wolman, is everything ready? Uh, the firewood's done. Vladimir? The gear's ready. You guys? Ready. Settle up then. Pakonyam. 
But yeah, the voice acting is that at least the English dub is freaking terrible. That's also a reason why I don't want to listen to it. This is cool though. I like this. That they've added like a genuine, like legit looking church thing here. With with Hez Hezus up there. Just chilling. Good old Hezus. Hezus. See, that's nice. It's like feels like a legitimate church kind of thing. Okay, we're going, we're going. But see, this is the thing that it's just so slow. They move. Everything in this game is so slow that you just want to outrun everyone all the time, you know? Like that. Like, what was the point in making Dark the move? Tunnel. Wheel rattle and the smell of death. That's how I do. According to the map, there are several ways of reaching D6. But the closest one is through the facilities near Kielska. Okay, we try that route. Kielska? We've heard strange things about that station. There was an explosion in the tunnel, and lots of people were buried alive. Rumor has it they survived, but no longer is it in humans. Supernatural time. Those tunnels are similar to the fog. Bullshit, probably. Of course it is. I believe it. Vladimir lost all his family in the tunnels. He doesn't remember anything but what happened. <laughs> See, this bit is really interesting to the game. I'm intrigued with this. Wake up, Artyom, wake up! Great, he's coming to us. Put the light away, you're blinding him. Artyom! Like, that Are makes okay? the whole game sort of interesting because you want to know what that's about, sort of thing. Artyom, who is that? We're arriving! There's an airlock here! Great, stop here! Hell, this place giving the creeps. Boris, take a look at the gate. Boris, Boris. The control unit is broken to smithereens. All the lights. Oh, pack some vodka there. Vlad, get your tools ready. We need this door open. Artyom, you stay here and cover our backs. We don't need surprises here. Sure. Okay, here we go. Another invasion, probably. Okay, Vladimir, find the first block chart. Hold on, look here. First we connect the wires, then on my map we throw the switches. Something's out there. Something's closing in. Ignore it. Going for us nice. At least it adds a bit of variety to the like repetitive stuff. Because otherwise it's just another repetitive gun battle, isn't it really? And it's freaking overpowered this thing. It's like you just touch them with a little bit of fire and they Oh. Okay. 
into it a little, a little bit more. Oh, it's that spark thing. Hurry up! The anomaly is really close now! Damn you! Hurry up, you're a fucking dead! That's it! The gate's open! We let it look start! <laughs> Bye bye, let's just start. Catching up, it's gaining. Uh. Oh, we made it. Well, I wouldn't want to be there now. Okay, let's get ourselves together. There's a long road ahead. Okay, guys, this is the door leading to D6. What's that? It's short. It's dark in here. Okay, go for it. The chaos of the tunnel was... All right, we've way. broken through. Let's do this fast and smooth. Rollman, you're in charge of the assault team. Boris and Stepan, you come to me. Atio, Vladimir, stay close to me. No. Okay, I'm doing this on my own. Oh, it's fun. Oh. It's no rest for the wicked, as you know. Father, my soldiers, great deeds away. Great deeds? Somehow I'm not too enthusiastic about leaving my mark in history. Okay, they've got spooky music. Something's gonna come out of that vent, that's for sure. Well, look at this. Someone left a skeleton here. Hey, how about we take it as a memento? Oil man, enough of the jokes, Blin. When we're back at the base, we'll be sweeping tunnels with a toothbrush. Yes, my marshal. As you say, my general. Last door's open. This is the first challenge. Atom. Well done, Atom. You just earned yourself a medal. Mm -hmm. Hold on, check the port. Oh, no. I ain't gone. It's dark and scary there. Shit! What's your name? Oh, what's your name? Oh, that's a great sign. <laughs> it's not a sign. Seriously, come on. You did a shift, then something left it. You both stay back. Okay, let's go. Oh, Carl, I can't fight in such an environment. It stinks so much, I lost the sense of smell. Boy, man, I wish you lose the bad jokes, please. I got some 
alien, né? But there's too many of them uh, for them to even be classed as like scary anymore, you know? They're just like annoying more than anything. And why can I walk through these like objects? You must not break through. Take a look what's behind the door. Oh, now I can use it. He was laughing then, just like ah, 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 ah. I've been grabbed by my legs Boys, and I'm gonna die. My friend, why? Oh, he's dead. Siban, that's enough. That was can't help him, Siban. Let's go. Yeah. What suit you? Boris, I swear on your memory, they won't rest. My love, my love. The goddamn beasts. Okay, there's a pumping station ahead. But they've had it like pool. super sad music. Like you're meant to be emotional that that guy Give died. Like, come on. Okay. And they quickly got over it as well. Just a little more. Oh come on. It's open. Gas masks on. Seriously, now I have to wait for them again. God's sake. Oh, Let's move. Do they want to move any slower? Like, seriously. I'll check it out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hurry up, you slow bastards. Hurry up. Come on. Over here. You know what? I'm really starting to think that I should have just watched like a sort of a summary on YouTube of this because uh, yeah, the fun levels of this game are seriously lacking. Bullets as well. Oh, 
can't see anything. Seriously. Come on, let's get out of here. Go. Move, move. Don't stop. I could have avoided all of that if they had just actually run down like me. Why am I? No, no. Stay positive. The ending will be good. The conclusion to this the spark will be worth it. Are we there? Uh, looks like it. A shot! It's locked. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Now what's up with that? It looks like a blast door. Okay. Go for it. Got it. Artyom, take a look at that room. Yeah, I can't kind of get through there at the moment. So, what do you want me to do? Oh, okay. You want me to crawl under? Yeah, I would definitely be rolling under that a lot faster. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. There's just loads of spider eggs everywhere, so there's probably going to be a giant spider. So, I hope it's not arachnophobia. Oh, scorpions. Apparently, if you hide in cubicles, they can't get you. Do I have to, like... Right. Why is there so many of them? Why do they take so many shots as well? Maybe it just wants me to run instead. Like, don't shoot, just run. Why can't I use... Oh, whatever. So two of my guns are currently useless. Oh, I see. They don't like it when you look at them. With the flashlight. They don't like it. So apparently they're not immune to it. in my hand, that's random. I've never had pins and needles in my hand before. Artyom, here! Oh, thank God, at least you're alive. We lost that one. Fuck! Okay, silence. A sound from the tunnel. Can't you hear it? Something's approaching. No, not again. What's up? Looks 
like an automatic system. Come on, get, get on the ghost train, everyone. Let's go. Anything on the ghost train? Any luggage? Oh. Seriously, can they just hurry up and get on? Somehow I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, come on. Stop pussing around. Just get on. All clear. Oh. There's no other way. Gotta take it. These guys have the reaction time of... I don't know what. The next station is D6. Welcome to the Black Mesa Transit Facility. I'm sorry, guys, but... We were close to D6 now. It was hard to believe that we'd found a legendary command center. But was it worth so many lives? No, it Soon, wasn't. We would know the answer. Okay. I'm quickly going to check how many chapters are left of this because I can't be doing with much more of this game tonight. Um, give me one second. Hello, everyone. It is me. It is Sharpie Plus. I am back. I'm having nightmares about this game. I need to finish it because I want to play something else. No, I'm joking. Fast, quick. Oop, I just took it off. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I'm wearing it. Hope you're having a lovely day. Uh... So, if you're still watching, it means that I've been to bed and it is now a new day for me. And honestly... Okay, this looks cool. I like the fog and the laser. Careful, damn it! 20 years without maintenance is too much even for Soviet military structures. Everyone watch your step, especially you, Artyom. Why especially me? What's that meant? I mean? Looks pretty clear. The control room should be there. And let's check it out. Hold this guy's gonna get grabbed here. Asses. What? You never know what's coming. Artyom, come with me. Oh, sir, yes, yes, sir. Ah, oh, lame. I thought someone was gonna pop up and grab him. And pull him over the edge. Okay, let's do it. Okay. It's clear. Oh, here we go. Through the trains. Not that away. This way? No. Oh, down here. Up we go. <laughs> Can't understand what he's saying. It sounds like blah, 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 blah. Okay, I can't click anything. Which means I've got to probably wait for him. Can he hurry up? It says here on the top there's an air filtering system for emergencies. This yeah, it's right here. Last, so there's a good chance it still works. Oh my god, please walk slower. Seriously, I can't stand this game. I'll get through it. You must be almost done, please. Love of God. Like, I want to know just how much time is being wasted waiting for these guys to walk. And like... Nothing good, Billion. We gave these machines too much credit. All these mechanisms have to be fixed by hand. At home, there's an auxiliary startup system. Go upstairs to that ledge. I'll tell you what to do when you get there. Come on, please. Open the door. Oh, this one. Artyom! Yep. Okay, so I've got to click on all these. Oh, 
Okay, open all the covers first. Done. Fourth, we've got numbers. Where are the numbers? Oh, there. in old Hollywood movies about Soviet Union. Hey, Colonel, what's up? We almost fell off. All good. I tell him let's move out. Enough playing with the equipment. Okay, move out of my way though. Because you are so slow. Where to? On the train or what? What are these plebs doing? What's going on? Are we getting on this or yeah? Go. Thank God we don't have to go all the way down. No, oh, something feels very wrong in there. Spiders or scorpions, whatever it was. It's a waste of a perfectly good knife, that is. Holman, go left. Professor to the right. That's your government. If the plans are correct, we need to go there. But how can we open this gate, huh? Any ideas? Artyom. I don't know, probably we have to go with all the spiders or something. But you're going to tell me that in like five minutes after you've decided it's time to tell me. Because you can't talk right now because that would be too quick. Now what if... Here we go. Come on, get that cog turning in your head. Oh, what you found... the door to wait for them to figure out how to open it. This is exhilarating stuff. Oh wow, it actually opened without them spamming about it for five minutes. You know, so far this is door simulator. So glad I decided to play this tonight. Are these guys coming in? Oh, he's going to look at the computer. Probably you have to wait five minutes until he finds what he's looking for, you know. But I'm sure he'll tell me when he's ready. Holman, hold the door. Vladimir, that's your field. What do you need? Now let me think. Um, instruction A124, page 3. Um, panel DS22. Alright, there it is. Superb memory, Vladimir. I always said the army was a worthwhile institution. All the training finally paid off. It's working. Now that's hardware. Excellent. First, died. Second, destroyed. Third, fourth, fifth, eighth. 
Sand? Jokey pokey, that's just gallant beer. Here, here's one. Now, now I'll get all the info. What the hell? What happened? Battery backup depleted. What about main power? Well, it looks like the reactor is deactivated. We won't be able to start it from here. We need to start the reactor manually at the lowest level. From the schematic, it's not that difficult. Almost everything is automated. <laughs> hey, stop laughing! How do we go down? Well, there's a lift just one level down. But there's a slight problem. To power it up, we need to switch off everything. Even emergency lighting. Then there is no other choice. Do it. Thanks, Volodya. Stay here and watch the readings. We'll be fast. Artyom, Olman, follow me. I am just... Come on. Come on. What is that? What the fuck are they? I knew it wouldn't be that easy. That little Here blobs. Here the sons of the apocalypse. Olman, change of plans. You stay with Vladimir and defend this position. If anything happens, I will send Artyom. Good luck to us all. Yeah, great. Good luck. Oh, let's wait for this lift to go down. Come on. Oh, God. Why is it so slow? Oh, maybe I can grab my knife. Shit, yeah, I can. There we go. Got my knife back. Disgusting. Okay, we might see some action here. Like, they needed more of the game like this, because I get the game is Metro and it's all in the Metro, but like... Look how well they've done this sort of like setup here. It's like much nicer. I'm sorry, but I'm not waiting for that guy for anything. He is so slow. So there we go. I'm stuck here. Oh. Is that meant to happen? No, that was not meant to happen. Okay, maybe we do have to wait for this pleb. Come on. The lift is over there, but the door is locked. Okay, we'll have to go around. Advance carefully. We'll cover each other. Okay, I'm advancing carefully. Ah, I see it says blobs that are spawning. Oh, I see the blobs spit acid at you. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh my god. What kind of enemies are these, honestly? Like, this is just... Honestly, this feels like lazy. It, it feels like they just kind of, they ran out of ideas. So they're like, what if we just have these little random blobs that have nothing to do with anything, spit acid at you? Because, you know, why not? Maybe if I hide over here. Okay, I can't run through. I have to do it one by one. We have to kill all of those little blobs one by one as we go through. Who thought this would be... Why doesn't my flamethrower work as well? But seriously, it's... Like, what is going on? With that flamethrower, I, I, it's like, like, I don't understand what I'm meant to do with it. And also, what's the deal with those like night vision goggles? We've not had to use them once. Like, 
like maybe there's something I need to I'm clicking like reload I'm clicking like every button here but nothing seems to want to power this flamethrower Same with this gun. Oh, I don't know. Well, we're going to have to let him shoot everything because we've only got six bullets for this. Oh, great. I'll trigger a couple of them and then he can kill them. There we go. Because he won't die. Maybe that's the way. Oh. Okay. Let's trigger all of these. And then run and hide. There we go. Also, why does that acid home in on you? Like I moved out of the way, but it like followed me. Like seriously, did did they actually play this and just think like, what if we make a really, really, like pointless gauntlet where it's not hey, this is the lift. I hope it's still fun. Works. It's got little random blobs. We have awaited your arrival. We are those who are called the Invisible Watchers. Your time has come. But now you will feel our wrath. Well, let's stop screwing around. Colonel, I have activated the loudspeaker. I have the signal from the lip switchboard on my console. I'll switch it on. That's right. Invisible watches. <laughs> How can you believe in that crap after all this? I'm just. I'm. Um, I'm just. I don't even. Go to the reactor hall. There will be a main reactor in the center, left of the control room. A lift goes down to the ground floor, and you will have to take the stairs up. Activate the switch for the means of the large lever. I will tell you what to do next. What the fuck? What do we do now, huh? Vladimir, if only you could see that. Okay, get ready, Archie. Okay, that's pretty cool. It's going to be hot. It's like a big intestine this or something. This shit on the floor is toxic for sure, and all the gas. We won't last long here. Okay, so let's run through, but... Oh yeah, sorry, you don't run or do anything remotely fast, because that would be... That would go against the game mechanics. Dude, you can handle yourself. Oh my god. Did you see that? The acid. They attacked me through the floor. Yes. Christ almighty. Oh, because it's these blobs again. So I need to run back. I need to let him handle the blobs. Because apparently they can also, uh, like, attack you through walls, like this. Okay, seriously, I've lost all respect for this game, I don't care. But I am finishing it. Okay, two blobs, take them down. Okay, I'll take that one. Wait for the acid to fall off me. Look how slow he's moving. Like, why did they think this would be fun? Like, moving literally as slow as anything when you can see exactly where they're going to pop out from. Take him down. I'll run around the corner where it can't affect me. Okay, there we go. That's everything. 
That's everything. Let's go up the ladder. Like, you know, fair enough if the gauntlet was a bit exhilarating or something. Like, it gave you something to run from or, like, a, oh, I don't know. I'm just... I'm so done with this. What's that? I don't even know what that is. Let's head into the bunker. The sight just makes me sick. Yep, got to wait for him to slowly open the doors. Okay, where is the lever? Uh-huh. I knew you could do it. Colonel, the system is automated. Just enter the command. Sure. This is your something done. Never thought I'd be in such a mess. Okay. Enter starter. One, two, three, four. Looks simple. They built it so even a fool could use it. Just pray to God it works. Colonel, it's all good. She's at one quarter power. We need a full charge. Keep it going. It's shit, Padiri. Oh, well, we won't do any better than that. Let's go. Second. Shit, man, what the hell was that? Now this shit is fighting back. This gets worse every minute. Yeah. How is it we went from Half-Life having that epic moment where you push the specimen into the freaking core and you have that epic explosion, the invasion of alien, and here you've got this door simulator, control panel simulator, slowest guy in history walking simulator, no doors being opened by me. Oh god, here we go. Now if I run, am I going to get killed by invisible blobs spitting acid through walls at me again or is it actually going to allow me to do something okay, what's this okay I'm moving the crane To like lift these up or something. Contact zone reached. So help me then if it's aiming at me. Attention, road removal in progress. the right and stuff this is come on go down contact zone reached come on the thing isn't going up or down attention road removal in progress drag myself there. I can't go any further. Or does he literally mean go back and then drag myself there? Ah, oh, here we go. Oh my god, move. 
We should go this way for now. Move out the way, please. Come on, come on. Yeah, you can you just get in the lift? will once again be filled with fast silver trains. Everything will be... Yeah, everything. Lovely speech. Moving. Epic. Uh, so tell me, Colonel, uh, is it easy to be Superman? I don't know, mate. I don't know. We're getting on the train again, are we? to correct the aim. You stay here and defend Vladimir. I won't guess our chances of making it, but try to reach our people and ask for backup near the tower. I'll be in contact. All is clear? Good. Artyom, let's go. Good luck, guys. Same old story, huh? Save the world while sitting waist deep in shit and nobody gives a damn. Miller and I, I don't I don't care about this, just Okay, we're back here again, are we? Glad to see you, Colonel. Did you hear that? Listen. What the hell? It's one of them dragons, probably. Turn the circle! Oh, not again. Here we go. Flamethrower doesn't work, and this gun doesn't work. But seriously, who, who thought that this would be a good idea? That you can't use guns that you pick up and it does It doesn't give you a way of getting more ammo. I've got no ammo, mate. It's it's on you. I can't reload anything. I'm sorry. I can only throw daggers at it in the middle here. Oh my 
got a gun. Back up! Yeah! Oh, thank Jesus. I can actually shoot again. Come on, let's get out of here! Go! Oh, another gun as well. Oh. Oh, two shots with that one. That was fantastic, wasn't it? All right, go, 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 go! Okay, that wasn't too bad. That, I mean, it still felt incredibly... What? Follow me, Jeff. I'm not again. Not again. For goodness. Where's that guy's gun? I'm just running. What's the point in killing them if that thing is just going to come down and grab me anyway? let him go first then if uh, apparently I'm just going to get one shot killed if anything touches me The, the annoying thing is the game wants you to do this in a specific way. It doesn't allow you, like, here, look, it wants me to wait for him, even though he's nowhere near me. I'll change. Yeah, I know. See, you need to, like, wait. There's, like, no freedom. It just feels like a really long scripted event this game like that there's no real freedom to it at all it's just like it takes you from one area to another puts you in a scripted event either makes you wait for these guys to open doors or sends a bunch of like enemies at you but you can't run ahead or do it in the way you want to do it you have to wait for them so it's done in a specific way that follows a script it's like and it's not even a good script at all Gosh, I am so negative. I don't think I've ever been so negative about a game. Probably, I mean, no, I haven't. Come on! 
And I'm clueless why so many people like defend this game so much. Like what's so in the army they said it will be fun. Brace yourself, it's gonna get a bit rough. Surely you would hold on to those. Like rather than trying to freestyle it like you're surfing the elevator, no? this door probably until he deals with that dragon or until another scripted event occurs no. oh, that's it that's the end let's see, let's see. am I going to have to do this again so it triggers another script or something Can't jump over, can't go round. So both doors are locked, so what? Drop down here? I I go around it. I'm just being negative for the hell of it now, to be honest. Oh, locked door, okay. Nothing there, through here. Another locked door. Come in, come in. We just, just some some off. Still going up. Ah! Come in, Miller. Miller. Shoot that jump! Our shoot. Miller, come in. Ah. Come in, Miller. Come in. Oh, finally, he's going to die. So I don't have to wait for him any longer. Oh, he's going to even take a long time dying, aren't you? Come in, Miller. I've been real much. You will keep him fast with that job. Roger that, Colonel. The laser won't do us any good here, Artyom. The clouds are way too thick. You've got to climb as high as you can and set the guidance system up. Move, boy, move. Everything depends on you now. I'm trying, but the door is locked and it won't open until you die, so please. Oh, uh, maybe I have to go this way. I go up again. Uh, another locked door. Do I have to drop down? No, you said go up. Go up. Where do we go? Door. Oh, I'll probably go around here. Uh -huh, okay. Got in the lift. No. I have to do something with it. What's it want me to do? Oh, can't drop in there. Oh, up here, here we go. Gosh, this isn't. So nervous in my life. Okay. What, what need to go down now? No, apparently not. I 
Me too now. Seriously, they don't make this very obvious, do they? Oh, look at this thing. Okay. I'm here. He brings death. I hope so. He's coming. He's coming to destroy us. Yeah, I am. I'm going to destroy everyone and everything. Oh, it's like rust. The old uh, puzzle jump. Oh, I'm dead. Yep, very much like rust. I was never good at those puzzle jumps in Rust. Fair play. Can't complain about that. That was actually all right. Stop him! Stop him! Destroy! Destroy him! Come in, Artyom! Come in! Sorry, I'm having weird Slender Man flashbacks. Nuke. Nuke them all. Artyom, this signal is just perfect. Hold on for just one more minute and we'll get them. You watch, it'll blow off the edge or something. You will be, you will be stopped. Ding. He cannot be, he cannot be allowed. We'll destroy, we'll destroy him. this is the only interesting part of this game is these weird slendermen and the like this kind of thing this is really cool they should have done a lot like and even this why didn't they do more of this look how cool this is oh they made me commit suicide no, they, that was just me committing suicide, apparently. Yeah, let's try that again. Empty door. Empty door. Empty door. Why didn't they do more of this? Stop him. Maybe they're just keeping it like rare because they know it's good. I don't know. Okay, fair enough. So don't approach them.
Like, I like that. That's cool, the way that they've done that. Like, it's all blocked off, and then when you turn around... Stop him, stop him. Suddenly it's, like, completely different. He cannot be, he cannot be allowed. He's coming, to, he's coming to destroy us. Like, that's kind of cool that they've done that. I should go to it if it's a trap. Oh, it was a trap. Oh, and now I'm going to have to do it all again. That I don't like so much that they... And now that it's just going to make me do the whole thing again, which is... I oh don't know. Okay, give me a checkpoint. That's all right. I can't believe it, but the game just crashed. Oh no, it's back. Don't worry. He's coming. To, he's coming to destroy us. Surrender. Surrender. I'm blocked in here. He's coming. To, he's coming to destroy us. So weird. I think the developers just put all their effort into this part of the game, to be honest. Because how is it that they've made this bit like so freaking cool, but the rest of the game is so scripted and boring and like cheesy? Like, okay, yeah, this is scripted as well, but at least it's, like, vaguely interesting, you know? Surrender, surrender. Right, okay, it's dragging on a little bit now. to know that first if it's hostile you kill it ah he was the guy from the beginning Achievement that I completed the game. The missiles are in flight. Oh, 
Where are those missiles going exactly? I wasn't even paying attention. Like they're hive. Oh, this thing. This man once said, he who leads a war for the love of his fellow men will defeat his enemies. I led my war protecting my family and friends, protecting my home, the metro. We had won. But to this day, I wonder, when we burned the dark ones from the face of the earth, was something lost as well? What? So it's not even going to explain. Oh my god. So after all that, I put myself through that game to to discover what that was, what the anonymous anonym anonym Anonymously? No, anon anonym anonymy? Anon uh, you know the the anonymal beings. The anonymy. Uh, yeah, whatever. I'm not gonna embarrass myself trying to pronounce that anymore. I always have trouble with those kind of words, but anyway. I wanted to see what that was. And all it gave me was a gun to kill one of them with. Like so I basically learnt nothing. I launched a few nukes on the hive there, but definitely there'll be another a million hives around. Okay. Review time. Um, I wrote down a few uh, things in my review already, so let me just bring up my uh, Steam page and I'll go over the points that I made. Uh, Definitely the first thing I wanted to say, I'll put them over here so I'm looking more at the camera. So the first thing I wanted to say is that one, I was shocked about how loved this game is because like, I, I think I get it in a way because it's probably similar to myself and Half-Life 1, like because back when I first got my computer, like Half-Life 1 was one of the first games that I installed. So obviously I spent like years like exploring every single part of that game, like, you know, using no clip to like go in unexplored areas, learning the bunny hop technique to speed run it, like downloading all the different mods that you could buy, uh, get online, like Team Fortress Classic, Counter-Strike, Ricochet, uh, opposing force blue shift all these different versions and the whole franchise is like a 10 out of 10 for me like the the world the story everything they created so maybe that's the case for these like we'll call them metro lovers or something who they maybe it was like a cult classic back in the day but for its time maybe it was super uh futuristic you know it was maybe next gen like when it first came out i don't know like i i just don't have that knowledge because i, I never got into that game back then the series um but anyway um so that's the first point i wanted to make that i don't understand the heavy love for it the other thing i wanted to touch on is because it's um the obviously it's uh a book originally like uh so maybe people who are really into that book uh, and the author maybe maybe they have a big strong love for it and they played this and that's why they love it um what else um the other thing that i thought is maybe that i've just been spoiled completely because the last game i played was titanfall 2 and that had some of the best gunplay in any game that I've played, like the guns and the weapons in that game just felt freaking amazing. 
um the combat was epic like it was the boss fights were cool like the the animation this there was no scripted events it 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 let you take the freedom and do stuff at your own pace if you wanted to speed run it you could do it if you wanted to take it slow you could do it even when there was like npcs like when you were waiting for bt to do something he did it at a decent speed that it wasn't slowing you down and forcing you to watch like whereas this game it seemed like every single event was a really slow paced boring event the with dialogue that uh, that's another point the dialogue i didn't find any of it interesting at all like the characters none of them were memorable all of them were annoying if i do say so like i didn't feel any connection to any of them at all um what else um uh the the actual dialogue itself as well the voice acting this is for the english dub and usually in games english dub is bad but a lot of games do english dub pretty good nowadays and this game isn't that old like let's see when it came out metro 2033 uh so the original came out in 2010 so that is pretty old to be fair so maybe i can forgive them on that but if you think this is a 2010 game whereas half-life and that was like 1990 yeah 1998 and for me half-life beats that hands down i know it's a completely different like you know level maybe but um another game uh fear let's see when that came out because that was a, a shooter as well uh fear it's on steam i think steam is down it's not loading uh 2005 so that came out even earlier and that game i remember when that came out the graphics on that game were considered like really top notch like really really good and okay it wasn't a perfect game but compared to metro much better what about bioshock that was another game um 2007 again came out earlier than metro so honestly it has no excuse for being this bad um on so many different levels so again just really really shocked with that honestly on how or why people are like so i don't know so into this game uh let's go back to my notes one second um the atmosphere i actually put down as pretty good like but i don't want to oversell it because it's not that great because let's be fair most of it like if you if you think about that playthrough that i just went through what was there was there any memorable environments that you saw or any places that you think wow that was that looked epic for me the only part that stands out is the tower at the end and the um there was one place like three quarters of the way through maybe where you you went into like this little inside kind of uh almost like a little mini city and it had like a little waterway underneath with the boat going through there's a guy fishing there was like a, a little science lab where they were operating on them that was so cool but you spent like two seconds there and then it shoved you into the next mission and you couldn't explore it at all so yeah they miss missed out a lot of opportunities for that because they had the, the graphics and the the atmosphere i think they could have done a lot more to spice it up because you spent most of your time in dark tunnels, which I get is a metro, so you can't go too crazy with it. But I think you could at least, like, you know, spice it up a bit. It was very dull, like, a lot of the time. And the, oh, and one thing I mentioned uh, related to graphics is the lens flares and the lights were far too disorientating. Like, if someone shone a flashlight at you, you literally couldn't see anything. And I get it, it's meant to be because it's dark and it would do that. But, you know, tone it down a little bit so you can at least see something, maybe. Like, there was no point to make it that over the top. Um, 
so yeah uh what else um the scripting i i already spoke about that every little zone felt like a script um it was kind of weird as well with the way that they separated the levels with that him talking into the journal and then you have him to click continue like it was like splitting up the chapters but the chapters felt more like levels which were over really quickly um so i think they could have probably thought of a better way of doing that maybe like making them a bit longer but more interesting and just having like the actual game tell the story rather than his journal entries telling the story at the end of it because those journal entries again weren't interesting they didn't give you any information and he didn't even in the journal entries i could be wrong but he didn't even speak about these weird supernatural things going on he was just like you know just talking about like his comrades and where he's going next sort of thing it's like what um story i mean honestly that story was so boring like the 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 idea and the universe that's created okay fair enough it's cool but it at the same time it is kind of generic i guess like in modern day maybe back then it was something like super new and interesting you know people living in a metro system and stuff like that like mutants it's it's essentially fallout you know the fallout universe but uh a bit more restricted that you can't go up as much and you're stuck in this metro system but a cool idea having the nazis involved in it that seemed a bit random and forced like they didn't really have much of a story there i i would have liked to see more of a uh like aesthetic change like so you know we were playing as the probably the ukrainians i guess or russians i'm not even sure what what we were meant to be there but um yeah basically you know i would have liked to see more character in their metro systems like that they have i don't know ukrainian flags around or russian flags or something like that and then when you go into the nazi section of the metro it, it changes completely like you'll have like a more imperial look like they've you know yeah red flags with the swastikas or something or like at least you know that symbol of the right or whatever it said i don't know just something that you feel like you're in a universe because let's face it if you were english or from the united kingdom or polish or anywhere and you got restricted down into a metro system and you knew there were other cultures down there other countries connected to your system other nationalities you would want to show your pride and have your flags around and stuff like that and you'd want to i don't know create a symbol and like you know a, create something and there was none of that it was just a really standard boring metro system and i know that you say that they probably they maybe they didn't have the um the resources for that but i mean they had freaking cows and pigs down there and stuff like that and uniforms and stuff so and you know they had all these guns i'm pretty sure they could have whipped up a few flags if they wanted to or something or some decor decor you know make it a nice looking place i don't know the whole the whole thing just feels like i don't know so many missed opportunities like maybe maybe it was rushed i don't know um the other thing that i've put is that it it doesn't have any solid character like you know it it tried to be a fps a horror like a kind of sci-fi thing with this like supernatural stuff going on and it it just didn't hit any of those criteria at all it just felt like a really dull kind of you know like it it just didn't have an identity is what i'm saying so yeah um what else have i got uh npc dialogue completely boring we went through that um interesting uh, atmosphere atmosphere was dull yeah um slow the game was really slow where it didn't have to be slow you know like they 
they slowed down the game just for the hell of it, it i think it's like maybe they ran out of budget or something and they were like okay we can't put m- much more development time into this but at the same time the game's too short so let's slow down these events a lot i don't know that's that's what i get the feel um um yeah so there was no like personality with any of the characters even our character you know he had no personality even those journal entries at the end of each level just nothing nothing there um the hub area is completely the same um uh, all the like the events that they created were that were meant to be like exciting and like exhilarating they just lacked as well like i think the scariest bit was probably those weird gorilla men that were chasing us but at the same time again it was done in a way where it wanted you to follow a script it didn't want you to fight them it wanted you to run away from them that was it and it's a shame because it would have been cool to actually i don't know kill those but lure them into traps and stuff like that or make them fall through the floor i don't know again missed opportunity whatever um and the good about the game like i said the the graphics the atmosphere was good in certain parts i really like that sci-fi uh stuff that they put together but overall i am just super disappointed with the way that game ended like what even was that ending at all i get it that we defeated the mutants and stuff but at least show us the mutants suffering or something you know, you know like on fire like you zoom in and maybe give us something that at least makes us like you know excited for the next game maybe like you know show one of those sci-fi like people just like i don't know like you know like maybe while he was sat there just coming up behind him and putting their hand on his shoulder something like that just end it in a way that there's a a cliffhanger or something don't just end it with oh by the way you defeated the sci-fi people by shooting one in the head what is that what kind of an ending is that i need to check actually is there multiple endings for this game because i know a lot of games back then did that uh multiple endings metro 2033 let's see I knew it. I knew it. There's two endings. There are two endings from Metro 2033. Okay, so I'm actually going to show you the other ending that we missed uh, out on. Also, I don't know why my mouse is doing that. Gosh, I've not seen that since like Windows 98. Jesus. Okay, uh, here we go. Okay, I didn't notice that. So it said die, die, but then the second time it says why, why. What you saw, Artyom. Force answers force. War breeds war, and death only brings death. To break this vicious circle, one must do more than just act without any thought or doubt. 20 seconds to homing procedure completion. So you don't nuke the hive. How can you want peace though when there's literally mutants?
A.G. Wells once wrote, if we don't end wars, wars will end us. And somehow, I stopped my war. At the time, I couldn't say what had made me spare the Dark Ones, but I came to realize that the strange visions that haunted my journey were their attempts to reach out to us. I don't know if I was the first to communicate with them, but I will not be the last. And the future, our future, stretches before us like an endless metro tunnel. That one's... Oh, God. Okay, that ending is possibly even worse. Possibly. It's more interesting, but again, leaves you completely in the dark. I get it, dark ones in the dark, but like, why? If they want peace, then... I don't know, that's just a really crap ending for a game. Like, it's got, like, who who's going to finish that game and be like, oh, man, what an ending. That was epic, you know? I don't know. They just, uh, I'm sorry, but I cannot find anything good about this game apart from the atmosphere in some sections and the maybe the, the world created is a cool idea. Other than that, I'm gonna I'm gonna end this video. I think I could go on this rant forever. Um, so for those of you watching, I hope you somehow maybe managed to enjoy that, but I probably think you didn't, especially that you're watching me who didn't enjoy it play a game that probably you didn't enjoy. So I don't know who this video is for really, because if I didn't enjoy it and you didn't enjoy it, maybe, I don't know, leave a dislike on the video? Just, you know, dislike if you dislike the game. But maybe if you like the game, like the video? I don't know. Like, do whatever. Just, just, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you had a good time watching, and hope you have a good morning, afternoon, evening, or good night. I'm Sharpie Puss Potato. I finished Metro. I'm never playing that game again. I'm going to uninstall it and hide it from my Steam library forever. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next time, hopefully with a better game. Sorry, people, don't you?